Yeah, more assault rifle. Assault rifle ammo. Fucking hell. Reminds me of the chainsaw guy from uh, Five. Oh dear. Yeah, I actually think what I need to do is kill this guy, and then we get access to the drill. Maybe. Yeah, we do. God, look at him go. Oh dear, I didn't reload. That doesn't do anything. Oh, there we go. Oh. Is that Pedro? Honestly, I can't tell. <laughs> Whew! There we go, we got the drill. Give us a whole lot more options. Oh, Barry. You and your corny one-liners. Never change. Whoa. I have a feeling that was Pedro. He was wearing the jacket. For terror save, so... He was the only one that was wearing the jacket. I mean, I don't think it was Gabe. Because Gabe was just wearing a tank top. Oh well. Alright, now we can go all the way back down to the bottom floor. Woo! I mean, I used up a fair amount of ammo for the assault rifle. <laughs> but it's fine. I'm glad that you didn't have to get rid of every single eyeball that covered his, uh, covered his body. Otherwise we would have been been there for quite a while. So that is what we could hear. Oh dear. Yeah, there it is. The drill. Oh, it's also this. Odorous chemical. Cannot remember what that makes. It's dead. I'll have to find another way. Oh. Way ahead of you. I think the odorous wants to make the decoy. Maybe. It looks like Natalia got kind of stuck. Alright. Whoa. Oh, it's a body. Woo. Oh, is she going to say this is where she got kidnapped? Or where she got separated from Moira? We don't really know what the hell happened. Aside from the fact they got separated. Rifle ammo. Natalia's carrying it all, so... May as well. I think we actually enter the building as Barry and Natalia, though. Almost certain, because it sticks out in my mind, because it's terrifying. Nice guy came and got me. Nice guy. The one from Terra Save who rescued me. Oh. I wonder if Moira made it to the tower. She made it. Come on, let's see what we can find. Okay, that's a weird. Why would the nice guy kidnap her? And if he was from Terra Save, again, why would he kidnap him? Claire's with Terra Save too. It makes no sense. I can't help. Oh, never mind. I thought this was going to lead to an item. Yeah, I definitely remember this because it, it's. Oh, I hate it. It's not a bad area. It's well designed. It's just. Super fucking creepy. And I do not like it. At least if I'm remembering correctly, which I'm pretty sure I am. I have a good memory when it comes to crap like this. Let's find out. Is it as creepy as I remember? Ah. Wait a minute. Is that Natalia? No. Actually, it could be. I wonder if he says anything about that. This place has changed. Don't say that. Yeah. Pretty creepy, huh? Also, don't say that. I don't want you pointing out how creepy it is. Oh, God, it is here. I hate this place. Yeah, goosebumps. I hate it. There's fucking baby dolls everywhere, and all over the wall it's sprawled with Natalia. How interesting. Fuck, man. God. Oh, yeah. 
One of my least favourite things in games has probably got to be like fucking baby dolls and mannequins. All because of horror games. Ah, oh, they just make them so much fucking more terrifying. I hate it. I mean, it gives it a good atmosphere and everything, it's just terrifying. Hold up. Well, we got it, somehow. Also, don't really like the music. Sheesh. Give me a break, man. Wait, so what does that say? Natalia Kill Crush Fuck me. God, I hate it. Ugh. Also this. Parting words to my dear father. You poor decrepit old man, you wanted to create a new world and rule over that as a uh, rule over that world as a god. But for all your ambitions, you couldn't overcome man's most formidable, en formidable enemies, age and disease. You had everything, but your crumbling body betrayed you. And then your own son snuffed out whatever pitiful entrails of life you had left, leaving you to become nothing more than a footnote in the annals of history, you failed old man. But fear not, your dream will live on. I will take the wealth of knowledge, power and test subjects you have given me and succeed where you failed. I will create the new world and I will rule over it as a god. Your legacy will have been long forgotten, but mine has only just begun. May your soul, if you ever had one, rot in torment for all of eternity, and let hell be filled with the sound of your teeth gnashing incessantly. Jesus. Bit fucked. What's at the other side then? If any- Hello. Didn't know there was a note here. Clinical experiment notes, 24th of Jan 2010. Trials of the T Phobos virus are almost complete. We've managed to reduce the lethality of the T virus while creating the condition w that it tr triggers upon the target being subjected to strong emotional trauma. We've also lowered the rate of viral resistance to below 2%. All is proceeding as planned, however, the time draws near. We are close to perfection and there is zero margin for error. Oh dear. I still don't like the fucking song. Not song. The sound. Just everything about this place is awful. I wonder, can I use this? Oh no, I can't. 11's my max. Oh well. God, why has it got to be such a creepy place? Does it get worse? I can't remember. Oh god, it does. Four. <laughs> oh, I hate it. Oh, because it makes a makeshift body. Oh man. This is what I mean when I say that Revelations 2 is really good. Good design. Fucking terrifying. At points, it's not terrifying all the time, it's just this is really not cool. Ah, God, end of the episode. Fuck. It's a love-hate relationship, for sure. I love this game, but I hate the- ah, the babies. Baby mannequins. That's what they might as well be called. Well, we're here. Made it to the tower. Oh, God. Yay, baby dolls. Literally everywhere. Wesker. <gasps> She's so scary. I can't stand her. Who? The woman here with Wesker? <laughs> she the overseer. That is Wesker. Wait, what? Alex Wesker. Two Weskers? You gotta be shitting me. <laughs> oh no. So you oh. Wait, is she behind him? Yes. What the hell? Okay. Huh? 
I mean, I assume Natalia had a bigger part to play in the game. And it's also very strange, though. Huh. I mean, I have pointed out. On Revelations Ooh. Two. What happens? Ooh, that's Wait. Moira's phone. This is Moira's. Figures. No, no sign of her. Uh, of course, this factory had to be oh, shit. the factory. She's responsible for the experiment six months ago. It's got all our names on it. Where did we go Ooh. wrong? Where's Moira? Oh no. Oh. One thing I actually realized with Revelations 2 is when it came to the episodes being released, they were released a week apart from one another. Next episode, Judgment. Yeah, I was under the impression that they were released. Like, not sporadic, not sporadically, that makes no sense. That they were re released, kind of like a telltale thing, like once a month. ASA! Constantly get ASAs. Unlock Countdown Episode 2, Invisible Episode 2. Uh -huh. Yeah, I thought they were released kind of like the same as Telltale, where it's once a month, basically. But it turns out it was released w once a week. The first was the 24th of February, I think. Then the 3rd of March, then the 10th, and then the 17th. I just found it really weird that people were... Ooh! Oh my god, I really wish I knew about that. <laughs> yes, they can now use our weapons. Ooh, that's a lot though. Follow up. Clan Barry are able to perform a follow up? A follow up to what? I've not really crouched all that much, so it's not all that useful. Crouch advantage, charge attack, rope a dope. Ooh. What the hell are these? Evade recovery, evade cancel, quick knife, quicker knife speed. Hmm, I really don't know what I want to go with. Ah, I'll go with both of these. And then... Firepower after the... F for the first shot after changing weapons. Yeah! That'll do. Yeah, I don't have enough. Cool. Hmm. I could see it being annoying for the release being so close together because it basically meant the game was finished. Like the game was fully sh the f game was fully finished. It was Pedro. I think. Hers is always red though. And he did die. Is that Alex then? I'm assuming that's the Overseer. And I'm assuming the Overseer is Alex. But no, what I was saying was, um, I can understand why people were annoyed. Because they released the episode so close together, which basically meant the game was finished, they just wanted to cut it up. Uh, confessions and lies are the same. To confess, one must tell lies. That's true. Right, now we're back to playing as Claire and Moira. And this is the episode I never made it to the end of. I didn't get spooked or anything, it was just... I reached a part where you get instantly... Claire, any luck? Mm, pardon me. You get instantly no. killed. No sign of her. What could have happened? If you veer off the path, and I didn't like it, so... It made me feel fa far too intense. Moira, look. Not far too tense. Oh, note! Someone left a message. It says... Head for the factory. Oh, great. And on a scale of bullshit to believable? Neil wrote this. It's legit. Oh! 
Wait, Neil. Who's Neil? Is that Fisher? Her boss. I can't believe we lost the girl. I didn't even ask her her name. She might have just taken cover. We can look for her as we go. She didn't. She got taken. By someone from Terra Save. Which we still don't know. But the fact Natalia refers to them as a nice man is the more interesting of things. On the plus side, playing as Claire and Moira, we don't have to worry about bullshit invisible enemies. Although I'm saying that as if they've killed me a bunch. So, uh, Claire? Why would the boss come here? I don't know. Neil just does things sometimes. Mm. Did I see something? I did. Is that an emblem? Oh my god, it was. <laughs> Eagle eye. I'm actually surprised I saw it. Damn. Not to be fair, I didn't know what the hell it was. I just saw something blue. A moss of green. Oh dear. We're being watched. Where are the enemies? Okay. I guess that just means we are locked in. Fun! It's fine, we're not getting attacked by a bunch of goons. So who cares? Hey! Yeah! Ah oh, fuck, even the... Bah! Even the inventory situation with this is bad. Full of all sorts. No space to carry near enough anything. Far too much cloth. Far too much cloth. I'm actually going to get rid of three of them. I don't need that many cloths. Is that the overseer? Something's not right about this. Be careful. Yeah, yeah. Great. I also realize that the bracelets are now orange. Don't know if it is for both. It is, which means they are both anxious. The one thing that really interested me about the next time thing was the fact it showed Moira with a gun to her head. Oh, hi. Kind of like an unsuspecting gun to the head though. This is Neil's. Oh. Behold Prometheus, who was bound to a rock for stealing divine power. That's nice. Where's Neil? If you want to see him again, you'll have to brave the scaffold of the gods. <laughs> Ah, great. If you want to see him again, you'll right. have to survive the bullshit. He needs you. Let's search inside. Hmm. So what's this do? A retinal scanner? Oh, great. Factory? Oh, no. God damn this. It's not going to let us through. Which means we need someone else's eyeball? Yay. Yeah, nothing like prying someone's eye from their head. Ah, uh, fun. Oh, wow. Oh, there's only one lot. <gasps> yeah! I kept saying machine pistol as well. And the machine pistol's this bloody thing. Which means I now carry all 82 bullets in one stack. Nice. I actually thought that was a grenade then. Alright, let's go. Into the factory. I don't think I made it very far into this place before. I keep saying like rage quitting, but I didn't rage quit, I just didn't want to proceed. Because it, it made me far too anxious. I don't know, because I thought if I veered off it would just kill me instantly. But I don't think it does, I think it gives you a chance to get back on the path. And if that is the case then, fuck, I just gave up far too quickly. Nothing hidden? Nope. I don't know why I care. We can't even get behind. Oh, bullshit. What I do want, though, is a map. Now, that would be grand. Hmm, bodies. 
Ah, oh, great. Now the question is, was that a mistake? Oh. Oh, this place is big. What the fuck? Oh. Got him. Was it two of them? No. Well, that's good. Odorous chemical. Oh, bollocks. I really hope that's not something that can happen frequently. I do not want them coming back as exploders. No, I don't. Oh, I can open. Oh, yeah. Wait, what? Odorous chemical. She can have them both. Alright, cool. Not bad. Ah, uh, dear. Alright. Question is, I'm just like, I want the map. So I'd mo mostly prefer to have the map. There it is. It's this room. The fuck? Yeah, we need that. But, in here, essentially on the roof, it's a bunch of lasers that will target you. I think they're actually in the corner. But they target you if you stay, ste not steer, if you go off of the path that's shown. And yeah, I, I made it like halfway through it and just turned the game off and then didn't play. I was playing on PS3 back then too. It was a while ago. Before I snagged it on Xbox on sale. Uh, key smokes. What is up here? It's a toilet! Ah, oh, of course it is! Ah, <sighs> oh, I'm not stupid. I know there's going to be something in one of these. Okay, maybe not. <sighs> Horror games have just conditioned us to expect things. Oh. Nothing there either. All of, all we got from that was some cloth. Hooray! Well, I'm glad there was nothing in the toilet. Okay, the only thing there is, is this. But I don't know. More things! Alright, what am I currently carrying? Both. Is that a decoy bomb? I don't know. I'll just make a fire bomb. It's a decoy. Decoy bottle. Need processing plant. Alright, only thing we can do is go upstairs. Okay. We still have this and the other one. Right, cool. If I remember rightly, there's a lot of enemies up here. Oh wow, we need another iBot. Eyeball to find a dead guy. Uh, it's, no, it can't be. That's what I say. It's probably his eyeball. That would make no sense because we need to get an eyeball to get to him. I heard chains. I wonder where from. It's not like they're dotted around the place or anything. Alright. I just want to be incredibly car shite. I can hear something in here. Yes. That didn't up. What? My question is, what? Which one is it? Oh, it's a regular. Oh god, fucking hell! Did not expect him to just charge at us. Yeah, fuck you. Uh oh. Nope. Didn't want to do that. Moira, get away from him. Yeah, she's fine. Hey, that, that works out better. <laughs> she can just get really badly hurt. Well, I'm pretty sure she heals over time, so... That really works out for me. I don't need to waste a herb then, do I? I really don't like that that happens, though. 
What? Okay. No, like any anything you kill seems to come back. And it fucking blows. Uh, of course this factory had to be a fucked up factory. Yeah, it's kind of a thing in horrors. Every location you go to has to be the most fucked up it possibly could be. It's kind of stupid. We can actually go go in here. Claire, look at the ceiling. Okay. Artificial eye. Or a key. Right. This episode has a lot of things that can possibly kill me. Great. We also can hear a lot of chains. Ooh. Is this one that needs processing plant as well? Yes. Great, thanks. I do just want to explore before I go through. Do I need something else here as well? I do. Oh. Don't know why I thought that would matter. These fuckers had better be Dornil dead, I swear. You've said it. You knew it. Jesus. Why did you have to say it? Are there more of them? No, I guess not. Yeah, she just had to say, they better be dead. Which of course means they aren't. What? Hold up. I knew I could see it. There it is. Jesus. Ah, uh, Moira. I'm just gonna shoot them instead. There we go. Yeah, screw you. He may turn. Maybe not. Never mind. Of course he turned. Jeez. Seven bullets. What a waste. Every time I kill one of them, I just have to assume they're gonna turn. Which really blows. Hey, Sapphire. That's not something I really want to be expecting. Wow, we have so many herbs. Thirteen of them. Not too shabby. Yeah, okay. I don't think there's anything else in here. Apart from the fact I can now unlock the door. Quite pointless when there's just, uh, you know, windows. You're shiny. No, I think my eyes are just playing tricks. Cool. We have to deal with the eye... ...and the key. One's the process implant, I think. Does it matter? I mean, this is gonna lock behind us regardless. Hmm. Let's find a way to pry it loose. Oh, we're not using the crowbar. Oh, hang on. Should just... Wait, just accept your death quietly like a grown-up. Oh! Oh. I thought it was that I was picking up, to be honest. Right, okay. We can take the artificial eye. <gasps> Does it lock us in here? I think I remember. Shite. Maybe not. Ah, uh, no, I do, I do, I do. Essentially, you have to wait for the spikes to hit the statue. I think. There we go. There. Ta-da! Alright, so now we have the processing plant key. And now I think enemies have spawned. Have they? I don't like the music. Oh, great. That's a yes, they have. Sheesh. Oh, bollocks, why is he here? Actually, sod it. Shotgun! 
You better be dead. Sucker! Oh wow, he survived three! <laughs> no! There, now he's dead. How the hell? Woo! I have a feeling he's gonna turn! And if he doesn't, I'm shocked. Right, I think they're all dead. Was that all the ones that came? Ooh! They did unlock this room for us, though. And so, for that, I thank you. What are these? Machine pistol? Shit. Ah, oh, really? 